the Benedictine Abbey of Saint Germain des Pierre Acutes, just beyond the outskirts of early medieval Paris, was the burial place of Merovingian kings of Neustria. At that time, the left bank of Paris was prone to flooding from the Seine. So much of the land could not be built upon and the abbey stood in the middle of fields, or pre acutes in French, thereby explaining its appellation. The abbey was founded in the 6th century by the son of Clovis I, Childebert I. Under royal patronage the abbey became one of the richest in France. As demonstrated by its 9th century polyptic, it housed an important scriptorium in the 11th century and remained a center of intellectual life in the French Catholic Church until it was disbanded during the French Revolution. An explosion of saltpeter in storage leveled the abbey and its cloisters, the statues in the portal were removed and sim destroyed, and in a fire in 1794 the library vanished in smoke. The Abbey Church remains as the Église de Saint-Germain des Pierre Acutes, Paris. In 542, while making war in Spain, Childebert raised his siege of Tharagotha when he heard that the inhabitants had placed themselves under the protection of the martyr Saint Vincent. In gratitude the Bishop of Tharagotha presented him with the saint's soul. When Childebert returned to Paris, he caused a church to be erected to house the relic, dedicated to the Holy Cross and Saint Vincent placed where he could see it across the fields from the royal palace on the Ile de la Cete. In 558, Saint Vincent's church was completed and dedicated by Germain, Bishop of Paris on 23 December. On the very same day, Childebert died. Close by the church a monastery was erected. Its abbots had both spiritual and temporal jurisdiction over the suburbs of Saint Germain. The church was frequently plundered and set on fire by the Normans in the 9th century. It was rebuilt in 1014 and rededicated in 1163 by Pope Alexander III to Saint Germain of Paris, the canonized Bishop of Paris and Childric's chief counselor. The Great Wall of Paris subsequently built during the reign of Philip II of France did not encompass the abbey, leaving the residents to fend for themselves. This also had the effect of splitting the abbey's holdings into two. A new refectory was built for the monastery by Peter of Montereau in around 1239. He was later the architect of the St. Chapelle. The abbey church's west end tower was pierced by a portal, completed in the 12th century, which collapsed in 1604 and was replaced in 1606 by the present classicizing portal by Marcel Leroy. Its choir, with its apsidal east end, provides an early example of flying buttresses. It gave its name to the quarter of Saint Germain des Pierre Acutes that developed around the abbey. This area is also part of the Latin Quarter, because the abbey donated some of its lands along the Seine. The Pierre Acute clerks for the erection of buildings to house the University of Paris where Latin was the lingua franca among students who arrived from all over Europe and shared no other language. Until the late 17th century, the abbey owned most of the land in the left bank west of the current boulevard St. Michel and had administrative autonomy in it, most clearly for the part outside the walls of Paris. Louis C. Acute S.A.R. de Bourbon, son of Louis XIV and Madame de Montspan, was an abbot here. In the 17th century the district of Saint-Germain was among the most desirable on the left bank. Marguerite de Valois pressured the abbot to donate Abbey land to her, too. She built a palace on it and set a fashionable tone for the area that lasted until the St. Honoré district north of the Champs Elysees eclipsed it in the early 18th century. Her palace was located at the current numbers chapters 2 to 10 Rue de Seine. The gardens of the estate extended west to the current Rue Belli Chassa. The tomb of philosopher René Descartes is located in one of the church's side chapels. Burials Childebert I, Chilprick I, Clother II, Bertruda, Chilprick II, Childeric II, Billet Child, Germain of Paris, Fredgund, 
John II Casimir Vasa, William Egon of Furzenberg, George Douglas, 1st Earl of Dumbarton, Lord James Douglas, William Douglas, 10th Earl of Angus, Jacques Barber de Berg, René Descartes, Nicolas Boileau de Spreo, former configuration. At its apogee, the abbey extended to the area now bordered to the north by the Rue Jacob, to the east by the Rue de l'Uricordi, to the south by the south side of the Boulevard Saint-Germain and the Rue Goslin, and to the west by the Rue Saint-Benoît. From 1275 to 1636, the pillory of the abbey was located in the current place d'Acadia, better known to Parisians as the Mabillon due to the eponymous metro station located there. This square was therefore called the Place du Pillory in the current Rue de Bouzy leading to it was called the Rue du Pillory. The pillory was removed upon the rebuilding of the Abbey's prison in 1635. It was located in what is now the Boulevard Saint-Germain, just west of the current passage de la Petite Boucherie. In 1675 it was requisitioned for a military prison. The prison was known for its extremely poor condition. For example, in 1836, Benjamin Appet wrote, the prison was the site of one of the September massacres of 1792 and was eventually destroyed to make way for the Boulevard Saint-Germain.